Hello, it's How To Man. Showing you how to jailbreak an iPhone running on 3.0.1 firmware. First, you can see that I am running on 3.0.1 firmware. And there it is. 3.0.1 right there. Okay. What you do need for this video is the iPhone 3.0 firmware, yes 3.0 not 3.0.1 and you will also need Red Snow when you first download Red Snow it should look like that the one on the bottom right there not the top one that's an older version you should extract the file and it should end up looking like that Red Snow 0.8 Okay, let's run Red Snow right now. You click run. And there it is. Let's minimize this. I'm going to browse my firmware. I have a lot of firmwares here. What you will need if you have a 3G, like the 8 gig 3G I'm using right now, you will need iPhone 1, 2. 3.0 and yeah well we click on that and it's processing the firmware as you can see it has been successfully identified now you click next it's patching the kernel preparing for Joe break data as you can see preparing the RAM disk I would like to install Cydia I'm not so sure about IC. I've never really gotten to explore it. Let's make sure your device is off and plugged into the computer. As you can see, slide, power off. It's turning off right now. Wait for this to turn off. There. Now, we will click next. Get ready to hold the home button, I think. Or is it? It's either the top or the home button. The power or the home button. Please hold the corner button down for two seconds the power button and the corner down for a couple more seconds and now without releasing the home button release the power button but keep holding it as you can see I am doing that a couple more seconds and now it's jailbreaking you can release your device set it down for now let it do its thing here and you should get a white screen for a while I've also seen cases where you don't get it but normally you should get it loading the second stage waiting for reboot and as you can see my iPhone is the light is on you can't really see it though but and now it's downloading the jailbreak data. You should just leave it alone during this short period of time. Updating the RAM disk. Whoops, a bit too close there. Now it's uploading the kernel. You should still be seeing this on your iPhone. Now it says done. 
and you can see the little circle at the bottom of my phone. And now you have the pineapple. It flashing an OR on your computer. It should say done. Nothing else should be loading at the bottom. As you can see, this has advanced a bit. Be patient people cuz this might take a while. Stalling bundles. It's almost done. Now it's syncing file systems. And then now it's rebooting. Now the Apple has shown up. Now you wait for your, the restart of your iPhone. If you have an iPod Touch, you shouldn't worry about the 3.0.1 update because it's only to fix an SMS vulnerability that the iPhone had. Nothing to worry about if you have an iPod Touch first generation or second generation. Uh huh, my iPhone has vibrated, which means it's almost, it's pretty much there. Just waiting for the lock screen, the password screen to come up. Yep. Now the password screen has come up, as you can see. There it is, you should have City. And I have, since mine was already jailbroken, I have a couple of apps installed from Cydia, such as Sidecorder, Winterboard, Installus, have Backrunner. And you should start up Cydia. And since mine was already jailbroken, I don't think it might show this, but you should get something about rebooting Cydia. And I apparently have to upgrade something in Cydia. But now that you can see Cydia is up and running, at least this part is, the home is still not loading. If you're new to this, you should know that Cydia always reloads data. So be patient. And we're done here. Well, that's all for now. Thank you for watching.